Hello everyone and welcome back to the Walking Dead Saints and Sinners. Uh, last time we got this thing for Casey, so today we're going to install it, uh, or we're going to do the maze mission, whichever is available, and we're going to need to take one sterile bandage with us. And, uh... Are you there? Yeah! Glad to hear your voice. Ready to get started? All right. Uh, let's uh, let's see. Let's wish me time. Ready as I'll ever be. Okay, good. So I found the manual for the pump flow regulator. It looks like we need to calibrate it before it can be installed. Each of the pumps has different flow requirements, and that component tells the rest of the system where to route the water. Let me solve it real quick. Hold up. Done. I don't use walker guts in this game a lot, so no point in grabbing more. Practically, since I prefer to fight. I saw a theory on this game the other day that Forrest is losing his mind. The character you play as is called Forrest. I think that'd be pretty interesting. Like, it's not really in the theory, but like the ending of Retribution is like none of this is actually like none of Retribution actually happened. It's just like Forrest going crazy. You're going to. And we're gonna be breaking into this place. Looks like neither of them got a a hand. That's a dumb joke.
The traitor bitch has been exploiting tower safe routes. So we are switching things up. Keep her on her toes. Maybe even rid the outskirts of some exiles while we're at it. New stirring schedule below. Georgia. Two crafting recipes, another axe, and another action. No, nope, I'll disarm that. No, nope, give it. No, I'd. Okay, it's disarm. Yeah, and shift. So we could upgrade a lot of these, but I think we could go with this. We carry more stuff now. It just practically beats out all of this. We can now craft that. And the ammo for it. So you know what? I think I'm just gonna I think it's about time we got a new gun. that and anyway switch this back. Well I thank you all so much for watching and goodbye.